It's time for Feathered Focus, sponsored by Teton Village Association. Hemlock is Teton Raptor Center's resident barred owl. Barred owls are medium-sized birds found throughout the eastern U.S. as well as a few areas in the Pacific Northwest. They are named for the beautiful brown bars of color across their chest and belly. Folks often confuse their name with barn owls, but they live a very different lifestyle. Hemlock is from central Alabama. He was picked up by some well-intentioned humans as a young bird on the ground and he imprinted onto the species that fed him. This has left him without his identity as a barred owl. When imprinted birds are released back into the wild, they often become nuisance animals. They hang out around roadways and harass people and their pets as they seek food rather than hunting on their own. This is why Hemlock now lives at TRC. His body is completely healthy, but his mind is irreversibly confused. Most owls actually leave the nest well before they can fly. They spend time on the ground exploring and strengthening their flight muscles while mom and dad go off in search of prey. It's not uncommon for healthy birds to be kidnapped during this time by folks assuming they were orphaned or in distress. If you ever come across a young bird on the ground and they appear otherwise healthy, be sure to contact your local rehabilitation center before picking them up and remember to never ever try to care for them yourself. Barred owls are found most often in wooded habitat near streams and creeks. They thoroughly enjoy food such as crayfish, minnows, and frogs, but will also take small birds and rodents. Barred owls will readily take to a nest box and they have one of the most iconic calls in all the land. Who cooks for you? Who cooks for you all? Can be heard from high in the trees, most often in the late fall and springtime. Hemlock is named after the Eastern Hemlock tree. Hemlock trees are evergreen trees that famously grow along the shores of creeks and rivers, helping to provide shade and cooler temps for the fish below. In recent years, the Eastern Hemlock tree has been devastated by an aphid-like species of insect that kills the tree, causing the needles to fall off. This is leading to warmer waters and fish such as trout are failing to successfully spawn. You can help eastern hemlock trees in your area by reaching out to your local extension office for ways you can help control these insects on your land.